Hey there YouTube, this is Dan Strong with Excel VBA is Fun. Today I want to show you how you can very quickly and easily find a specific uh, video that you want or you can actually do a search on somebody else's YouTube channel or mine. Uh, particularly, I'm actually going to show you mine. So if, um, if you go to my channel on YouTube, which is Excel VBA is Fun or YouTube.com slash Excel VBA is Fun. So let's, I'm, I've logged out of uh, my account so I'm actually logging in as um, someone else or just as like uh, no no user here I'm gonna pause the uh, the the thing that plays on default and here's what you do uh, whenever you go to their that person's channel you click on the little search button right here so there's home videos discussion about and then there's a search hourglass that tells us that we can search for videos so let's say that I wanted to search on how do you get the sum using SUM. How do you get the sum or the addition of something in Excel VBA? We'll see if Excel VBA is fun has any videos on that topic. So I hit enter or you click the search button and here's all the things that I have the word sum in whether it's the video title or the video description. It's going to search all those in my particular channel or whatever channel you might want to also use this on. You just go on their channel and you click on the search button and boom so this will help you guys. Uh, I get a lot of questions every day on do you have any videos on this? Do you have any videos on that? And yes, I'll be happy to help you, but please first go here and try to check, uh, try to search my channel by uh, search terms. You will also find that I think uh, the tags that I've listed on some of my videos, this search bar might also bring up. So if I didn't have it in the title or the video description, I made up for it by putting it in the tags. So either way, you should be able to find it. So once again, you go to youtube.com slash excel VBA is fun and when it comes up, you click on the hourglass and begin your search. So let's search for something. Do we have anything on loops, I wonder? I'm going to hit loops and I'm going to hit enter and here we are. There's several things with loops in the title. How to avoid infinite loops. Um, that's about uh, application events being enabled and disabled for a next using loops there um, uh, making uh, looping through a table without loops looping through a database that's very important um, if then statements with for next loops for next loops using dates and things about that so yeah definitely check it out and uh, check out whatever you want to search otherwise uh, I recommend going to going to the playlists so if you click on the home tab right there you've got different uh, playlists. This one says popular uploads. But then there's the tips and tricks series right here. You've got the playlist series. Let me pause this video here. There we go. So we have the tips and tricks. You can actually just hit play if you want to start from the beginning. Otherwise you can actually uh, click right or left to go up a little bit on, and there's 30 more in that series. Tips and Tricks is uh, one of the most popular ones I have, but I would I suggest that you start at the basic series. So um, here's different playlists. Uh, this will bring up the entire playlist, sample programs, software tutorials, user forms series. It'll start you from the top. If you want, you can click on the titles, and then it'll bring up the whole the whole playlist. So I recommend that you start at the basic series. So I'm going to click on there, basic series. And voila, here is the listing, one, two, three, etc. You can start anywhere you want. And if you click on these links, conveniently enough, as soon as, let's say, this video number five here, if I were to play it, as soon as it gets done playing, the next one in the series will start playing. And these are in chronological order, in the order that I filmed these and edited them and uploaded them. But uh, the basic series, I did try to put in uh, some kind of order that would help people. I uh, but mostly these playlists are in chronological order. Uh, if you just start watching one, I guarantee you that you will continually uh, learn new things. So you will be able to be an Excel wizard, somebody who can really maneuver and make and build awesome things. So also, don't forget this big red beautiful subscribe button. I want you to click that if you have never clicked it before on my channel. And that way you will always be updated on the most current recent videos that are being uploaded all the time. So you'll get an email from time to time from YouTube if you've signed up for that for free. 
and that will tell you uh, what's been going on so you'll get updates all the time and um, be sure and click like on the playlist if you would um, if you bring up a video that is in any way enjoyable to you click the like button it'll take you one extra second out of your day less than one and it will really help us out here at Excel VBA is fun so click like and click like on the videos and and I want to hear your comments in the dis comments and uh, so type any comments questions thoughts reviews whatever uh, and I, I love the uh, the appreciation out there too I appreciate everybody with your your, your kind words that it's very um, it's very inspiring and helpful to me to know that it is actually helping somebody out there so we'll keep on kicking and you guys just uh, use that search bar now that you know how to use it so thanks for watching and God bless